against Drago. As you said, that is a second attempt for Nelkael as he was there last week and lost to Mystic. Drogoy from Team Rov. Rov who uh, announced earlier today that they picked up also Albur, another insane Spanish player who made Nagoriuki just, at your, just like Hyria Legion. So definitely really hyped to check out if uh, this new sponsor will uh, do anything to propel Albur to uh, bigger heights. But this is not about Nagoriuki, this is about Dragoy and Nel Kyle. And let's get the show on the road. Yep, let's see that. I know that uh, Nel Kael, he won uh, Akural's uh, qualifier. Akural plays Leo. So Akural was super happy. was like, yes, finally, Leo wins my own event. That's what I want at the moment. Nel Kael trying to challenge that one. And I'm very curious about this specific matchup, right? I feel like Kai has the tools to at least keep Leo away. But, you know, when Leo becomes Leo Gorilla mode, it's really hard to stop. Anyone stop Leo Gorilla mode? Nice throw the first cross up attempt from Nelka. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> what? The DV in the face, that is definitely something. From you madman! You ma he, he knew that after seeing the slowdown from the BRC. He would press a button. That is the hardest of reads, man. And that's what Dragoy opening the set strongly. He uh, breaks the wall here. Boss uh, bonus about to trigger for Dragoy as uh, Nelka gets a hit and oh, there's the dirty uh, cross up here. Goes for back and once again does not opt for the cross up. This could probably be a wall stick once again. Yes, it does. And he will break the wall with the super very short uh, range on that first hit. But the man just to get a hard knockdown. They're pushing with two bars of tension here. Oh, right, the lightning! Oh, then, there we go. My god. That was quick work. I can't lie. That was. <laughs> that was a statement. Drago was like. I'm invited. You want a qualifier? I don't need to win a qualifier. I'm invited to want it. <laughs> God damn. Let me, let me show you what I'm invited. That's what he said. <laughs> and you know, like, in a, I need to review the exact stats, but I think it's 13th episode of Wanted right now. And I think in 13 episodes, the guest only lost, like, twice to the qualified player. You know, which proves that the guests are always, like, some of the very best. And qualifying it from the tournaments doesn't mean you're going to have an easy road at all. Exactly. It's, uh, it's definitely uh, an uphill battle for Nelkal as he faces one of Europe's finest Dragoi force to use nice. adverse early. Oh, nice plastic here. Will it be the battle of the DPs as uh, Nelkal pressing forward? Nice cross up into another cross up from that back turn stance into another cross up. Bit better here for Nelkel, but nice uh, stun dipper. Before we get a Wasik, no, goes for the stun edge. Alright, oh, he's gonna give some pressure. Oh, presses the button immediately, challenges. He wanted the throw, but jumping away on Nelkel's side helped him punish it. And that's going to be wrong. Nelkel looking to potentially uh, immediately equalize, but excellent answer straight to Gold Burst, though. Big damage. First vehicle from Dragoid, this will be a full combo from Nelkel immediately at a big uh, life advantage. Okay, good blocks, good defense from Nelkel. Oh, no. oh, blocks the burst as well! Oh no! That's gonna be time for Dragoid to get some, gets the Oki just waiting and you know what? Oh! He actually blocked the faster C into cross up that was already big enough, but Nelkel is still there. Nelkel gonna get the opening and that was a lightning fast. Equalizer from Nelkael. It's 1 1. Yeah, surely looking to be a much closer set than the previous one. Uh, both tied at one game apiece. Um, definitely, both players making their characters look uh, at their best, their yeah. finest. And so it's definitely going to be uh, who knows uh, the, the weakness of, of the other players. I think this is totally going to become a player matchup with a character matchup. It's one of the things with the first to seven, right? First to sevens are usually long enough that they become a player matchup. That's what we like about them. Let's see. Immediate wall break. Dragoy starts strong, but Dragoy now has to deal with the offense. Capable of dishing out that offense. Gets a wall stick very early on. Oh, from Nelka. Oh, nice. Uh, Forrest Nelka to use the burst. 
There is the uh, dust, however, not charged, but still able to get a combo from it with the RC. Sun Edge, who oh, blocks the TP, very smart. Oh. He locks the crossbow, but then no. this time the dwarf blocks. Oh my god! And Nelkyle looking to close it out. No, he doesn't go for it. Oh, he it. oh my <laughs> god, Dragoy, that was so freaking clutch. The DP that somehow hit from behind because hitboxes. And then he had the presence of mind to go for the bigger, the longest range dust to make sure that Nelkar was not waiting for this one. Right, blocks the overhead. Drago waiting, gets to take as well, back on the offense. That was sick. Indeed, as uh, Nelkar looking to even up the round count here, gets the overhead, does not get the final hit, the, the, the kick, which uh, also guard break, goes for the charge, does off his own, nice defense from Drago, but the offense is still from Nelkar going for the reverse, a nice jump from Drago, who still gets clipped. Nelkar looking to break the wall, doesn't go for a super, a little bit of an interesting choice. Oh. Okay. The, uh, sacred Edge. Nice throw attack. Alright, keeping the pressure on. Got to watch out because there is bar, so of course you can flash kick into the RC. And regardless, that's killing. Nelkai looking good, evening it up. And an important round next. Whoever uh, will go into the lead in the set. Okay, nice jump over of the projectile from Dragoy, unleashing his own projectile. Nice block on the slash. It was with big damage. Trying to bait out the burst. There it comes. Still, Dragoy got a little bit of damage. Into the stun he got once again, getting to apply those plus frames. Nice uh, RC on the uh, stun on the stun dipper. Another stun dipper. A little bit uh, of a believer, but nice throw into the cross up attempt. Oh, another cross up from Dragoy. Very interesting. Oh, that's gonna be big. Just gonna put him in the corner now. Dragoy doesn't need much more. And he's just waiting now. He's playing the footsie game. He's not trying to overextend. He doesn't need much. Don't give Nelkael a chance and he does not. That is gonna be 2-1 for Dragoy. Excellent play by the Spanish player. Nelkael once again has to uh, chase after the scoreboards. Will we get a 2-2 though? Very clean round from uh, from Dragoy showing uh, excellent defense as well as, as offense and uh, he's constantly keeping his, his opponent guessing. He's, uh, he's using stun dipper into RC and he's conditioning his opponent to, to actually uh, not punish it in fear of of a cancel from Dragoy, which is an excellent stack, especially on one of uh, Kai's core moves. So this could uh, probably be a little bit of conditioning earlier on, which could uh, work very nicely in the uh, in the distance. Throw from Dragoy once again. The cross attempt nullified, but nice flash kick from Nelkel getting out of the, of the corner. Oh, he's getting a solid conversion as well, but straight to the burst. Dragoy had to get away from this one. Stun deeper. He's gonna PRC and okay, that's gonna be teched. I've seen a lot of throw techs in this set. Both players either uh, reading the other's intentions. Uh, awkward burst from Nelkael and now Dragoy putting uh, the little player into the corner. Stun Good block. Okay. Vital block, otherwise he would have been dead, but there's the throw. And Dragoy wanting to kill off oh. Nelkael. He doesn't block this dust and he's uh, he's definitely gunning, going to pay for it. Let's see if Dragoy can go two games up. Trying. Oh no, that's gonna be blocked. That smells like big damage. Smells like big boy punish into the super. Dragoy was way too ready for this one. That one flash kick from Nelkael. And a big paid in cash. And Dragoy on his way to a potential 3 1. Oh my god, the jump. Very unfortunate, Dragoy. That's <gasps> actually make it out but the right the lightning will steal the turn and the game from from Nelkel who was looking to put up some very innocent offense with the back turned Leo um, but nothing doing Dragoy will go 3-1 up and for whoever did not know may I remind the chat that Dragoy is 18 years old 19 years old three young right here and uh, look at how sick he is man it's it's just there's something with the young people man because like they they just they just have a different risk reward thing than than us adults. That's uh, that's my option select. <laughs> they, they see the reward and not the risk. It's exactly it, man. <laughs> that's that. You you see sometimes see like that DP. That is a young man's DP. That is a person who does not pay taxes. No responsibilities. I just do whatever I want and I deal with the consequences. Uh, Nelkael dealing with the consequences of having to face a top tier opponent in Dragoy. Nice jump H there into the RC. No burst available ah. from Nelkael. Oh, uh, awkward uh, 
DP there, another DP, the next one was not as awkward as the former one, nice block on the YRC and the Direct Club will finish off, Nerkaya Dragoy risking to run off with this set as uh, a strike easier ran away with the previous one, nice block on the projectile. Alright, Dragoy is looking good so far, he's gonna get the extension, putting Nelkael into the corner, and at least the flash kick to get away, gonna at least get it back, nice, we're moving, we're moving. Not a big damage, but the mix is still there. The overhead is going to open him up. And Drago is struggling on defense right now. There is a burst. Nelkael was trying to bait it, but no chance. So patient. Unfortunately, the stun dipper going under uh, the Leon, which uh, makes for uh, Nelkael's oh! luck. Okay, nice. First bait there with the jump cancel. Switching sides once again. Drago now having the opportunity to pressure Nelkael at the corner. Would Nelkael be able to get out the reflect? Nice. Getting out of the corner with that 236P, I believe. Okay, jump H though from Dragoy into the throw. The Kai special. Okay, nice block. Big dust into the air though. Unfortunately, not able to punish, but still Nelka comes up the corner excellently and gets around on the board. This is not looking as one sided as we probably thought. Yeah, Nelka is definitely making sure that he keeps up. Important game as well. There's a world of difference between 3 2 and 4 1 right now. But now it's Dragoy with the opening. Can't extend more. Another food rack, but that's that one is going to be punished. And he does not care. He is going to DP on wake up. And sometimes in his scene, he should it, right? Sometimes. Oh my god, what a parry! That was sick! Okay. Oh, nice jump back of the throw attempt into the jump heavy. This could probably be an LK round. No, just not enough for the kill. Jago is still living with a slither of life. Merkel has to close it out. The, uh, death, the, the momentum is in his side, but Dragoy wants to steal it, wants to make. Nelka will regret it, but he won't because a nice jump back into the jump heavy will mean that it is now 3-2. Yep. And Nelka will definitely making strides to uh, to even up the score. Yep. That's a excellent play from uh, Nelka side there. He's uh, going to try and make it 3-3. Check if you guys do believe in the 3-3 so far in the bets you do. Nelka looking to even this one up. And he's definitely showing that he can do it, right? As much as Drago is very often in control. We, we do see Nelkael, like, just showing moments where he's in control. And that's what you need to stay there in a long set. Exactly, and uh, probably Nelkael can get some experience playing uh, Times Up, who is another uh, very good guy from, from Italy. The name uh, just came to me uh, just now, so I just remember <laughs> that uh, he is a very good player as well from Europe. But nice stun dipper into the RC from Dragoy. This will be big damage, no RC for Nelkael. Uh, Direct lots to break the wall. Nice food rack once again, keeping those boss frames. A little bit of a stare down between these two. Stun the pair. Nice blocks, no punish from Nelkel. Probably wanting a little bit too more than he could actually afford. And the 5k will kill off Nelkel Dragoy, wanting to re establish the two game lead that he actually had. Yep, let's see if we can get this one. Guess the instant air dash. Keen one from Nelkel right now. Keeping the pressure on. FD to create some space. Nelkel is forced to block. And he's still gonna block for now. No flash kick just yet, he doesn't have bars of course to potentially cancel it and look at the pressure from Dragoy, relentless, putting him in the corner, we're getting close to a wall splat. Twice in a row, but Nelkael getting out of the corner very nicely, he has to uh, force, uh, get forced to use the burst. Okay, uh, 2k into the mix up, another uh, mix up attempt, Stun uh, Dipper will connect and just like that. Dragoy will re-establish uh, the two-game lead that he had, and it is now looking uh, quite good for Dragoy. Nelka is surely not out of it by a long shot because he's looking very good, but I think that Dragoy is uh, is more adept at closing out these hairy situations, which um, they are putting each other in. Probably uh, Nelka can adapt with, with time, but... Will, we, will he have the time or will Dragoy be able to close it out uh, before Nelkael can do anything about it? Yeah, I want to see that. It's going to be important for Nelkael to keep up. So far, he's shown that he can, you know, just keep up with the score and not let Dragoy get away with momentum. But that's a strong opening from Dragoy. Keeping the pressure, not yet. That whiffs and we're going to have Nelkael on the offense now. Uh, Nelkael to uh, close the gap here and get another overhead. This will be a wall break. The first time we're seeing the Project Now Super from uh, from Nelkael. Let's see, a hard knockdown here was the mix up. What though? The stun dipper from Dragoy forces Nelkael to use a burst. Um, 
good choice of a burst, I feel. He keeps on the momentum here. Draco is sitting on his own burst, and uh, he smartly does not use it because it was a losing ground. Now Kel getting himself on the board in this game. Yep, let's see instant air dash now. Tragoy looking to uh, reclaim some pressure, get a throw at least. No burst on Elkael's side. He'll have to uh, commit to a defensive option now. He's just waiting, just happy to block. And manages to challenge at the right time. Pushes Dragoy into the corner, but the stun deeper to get away. It's a good round for Dragoy. Very good round from Dragoy. Nice bank dash from Elkael, but the range of that food arc is uh, immense and manages to still manages to uh, make him block. But look at this cross up set them. From Nel Kyle now going in. Nice fast RC into the cross up Dragoy. Forced to use the burst. 2D whips. Still a good life for Dragoy. Can he able can be able to close it out? I think he yes. can. Yes, he can. With the DP. Will send uh, Nel Kyle crashing into the next round. And this is another pivotal uh, round in this set because uh, Nel Kyle cannot afford to go three games down. But Dragoy pushing forwards his uh, the Kai special, the run up into grab, working as good as always. Nice bit of damage from Nelkael though, be establishing the uh, the life, probably very even. Oh, gets another counter. Oh, that burst. Well, it's not a big punish, but at least we get some kind of Oki. That's okay for Nelkael though. Let's try to get a bit more. Mix, left or right. We stay left. There we go, the RC. Putting him in the corner. Mix again. That's gonna be overhead. That's gonna open him up. We're gonna get all the bounces. Can you build that super? No, you can't. Like that, Dragoy is still living, still with the possibility to steal it, but Nelkael will prevent him just upon landing as he receives him with the uh, with the cross swords, and uh, it's four three, so so close. Definitely, uh, what we love to see, Nelkael putting uh, the pieces of the puzzle together. Can he actually uh, tie up this set, and or will once again Dragoy go to a two game lead? Every single time he had a chance at tying up the set, he failed so far. So let's see if you guys believe. In that 4-4, bets are open. Let's see if Nelkael can bring it back against Dragoy and even the setup for the first time. So it's very early in the set. Right. A lot of jumps from uh, Dragoy. Nelkael forced to use the burst very early on. Nice jump, heavy from Dragoy. Not able to connect it was a little bit too far, but the DP very smart from Dragoy, but still. A little bit too far for the dust, still manages to capitalize on it. This will be big damage. Oh, does not have to go for the full combo. The, uh, oh my god, no. On the cross up attempt, showing that he's definitely on the. Uh, in in Nelka's head, and big block on the YRC Dragoy. Once again, not as Nelka tie up this set as he's looking so dominant, more than ever, perhaps. Absolutely, that was a fast round. And it feels like every single time Dragoy is pushed into a difficult situation, he just makes it work. Trying to get the jump, great anti here. They'll carry the pressure. Or oh, the 6p, but a bit too far to get anything there. Dragoy trying to escape, he's gonna at least let this whiff and full run. Still Dragoy fighting out of the corner, he manages to get out so well, running and dashing. Up to uh, to Nelkal and now Nelkal is the one in the corner, but Nelkal still manages to fight back. There is the cross up attempt. It manages to succeed, but Dragoy gets a throw off his own now. Nice jump, heavy. This could potentially kill off. No, he cannot. Tries to go for the cross up attempt. Nice defense from Dragoy. The trade on the stun dipper. Another stun dipper works out for for Dragoy this time and again. Nelkal in the corner trying to defend. Look for the direct clock. Nice uh, stun dipper. I think that was uh, a little bit of a setup for the direct clock. Pushing forward, the air throw, Dragoy can close it out to the jump, heavy, and that will be the fifth game for Dragoy. Once again, Nelkel denied of uh, of tying up the set, and uh, Dragoy keeps running away, keeps two games ahead of Nelkel. The safety distance, I mean, uh, we are in, uh, in a pandemic, so Dragoy very smart and uh, very diligent to keep the uh, social yeah, distancing at two that. games apart, two meters apart. And uh, two games away also from uh, from closing out the, the set. Man. Two games away indeed. No 4-4. Four, four. Shout out to the one person who put like one channel point on the no. <laughs> get uh, get your money. Ooh, big damage to open this one. You can't just burst that. Yeah, that's a good burst. Good, uh, burst 
first seed from Melkael, but still the damage has been done. Drug Royce hitting get a good life lead. Nice stun dipper to get the punishes will uh, proceed to uh, make Melkael once again the cornered animal that he has been for much of the set. Pudrak plus frames, you better not challenge it as he does not. Melkael though receives another counter. The stun dipper, nice punish on the stun dipper. Gets a little bit of damage, but most importantly gets out of the corners. Another stun dipper will mean that Drug Royce will be one round away from going 6-3 up. And uh, Nelkel now has a lot of work to do. Starts off very well, pushing towards the corner. But Dragoy, once again, the jump page has been done doing so much work for the Spanish. Yeah, definitely. That jump page is getting so much. Every single time he gets a counter, he's got time to run in, get the damage he needs. Oh, he's gonna look for more, but no, straight to the burst. Nelkel looking to save his life, but not gonna lie, it's looking really, really difficult for Nelkel right now. Dragoy on his way, fix the lobby. He's gonna get some more pressure. The dust doesn't have anything to cancel it, but gonna keep the pressure and the yellow RC. No one cares about your yellow RC. I'm pressing buttons. Uh, honestly, uh, uh, from my memory, I think all the YRC attempts from from Nelkel have been blocked. I, uh, I mean, correct me, uh, Damascus or Chad, but I, I think it's three out of three uh, YRCs blocked from Dragoy, which I shows so. the. The young man reflexes are really strong in this one. And uh, now Dragoy sitting on set point one game away from potentially setting up a date with Trikezer in the bracket finals of today. Let's see if that uh, will, uh, will let him take it easily. Yep, that'll be a really clean one. Let me know if you think the 7 3 will happen. The bets are very balanced right now. But let's see. Putting the pressure. Nice challenge. Belkael. He's gonna get some damage. And just goes for this, but. What? That, that worked? I, I'm surprised. Call me surprised. I mean, uh, match the win, right? And immediately Dragoy secures Nelkel once again into the corner, who now gets in, gets a nice bit of damage. And now RC, the momentum is in Nelkel's favor. He cannot afford to lose this round, but Dragoy comes out, throws him, and immediately this is looking quite ugly for Nelkel. He to 6p. Oh, wait on the DP. This could be a, a Nelkel round. Still not over. Still time for Dragoy to hold ha. the projector. Will chip him off. And uh, he did not FD. Why. He did FD, but I did think he? he released it. I yeah. don't know why. I, I know I saw the the FD coming in, but uh, not sure what happened there. But uh, I know what happened is that Nalka got himself around. He cannot afford to lose any more. As a uh, nice block on the stun zipper. Good defense from from Nelka, trying to uh, chip off more life. From Dragoy, Nelkel is sitting at a life lead in this round once again. Nice defense though from Dragoy. Okay, go. So Nelkel building up a little bit of offense. Dragoy sitting on that burst. Nice 6 speed to counter the jump in. Looking good. For Nelkel trying to save that first match point. But you got to watch out. But it's never over with Dragoy putting the pressure in. Oh my god, what a hard read. Oh no, he could have killed with this. He's not gonna get more. Fix Talobi into the dust. I don't care about your dust. I am pressing buttons. I got an invincible reversal. And it is going to be 6-4. Melkael manages to save the first match point from Dragoy. <laughs> I'm sorry for the scream, but I did not Damn. absolutely see that DP coming. What a clutch DP from from Nelkel, otherwise he would have died and lost all the momentum that he had built in that round, which would have killed off the, all the mental that probably uh, could have done him good. But Nelkel gets a game on the board finally after a draft of uh, three games. And now the momentum is in his favor, not by a large amount, but still he is in the uh, in the driving seat, putting on the uh, the pressure on Dragoy. All right, looking for more. Nice one. Ooh, Stand wait, actually, he, is he dead? Yes, dead, dead, dead. Damage, your Nelkael is bringing it back in a strong fashion right now. Drago has got to watch out. Yeah, I mean, uh, why not have an OTG super can pick the wall? I mean, very fair. And Palace, especially on a character like Leo, who is now forced to use the burst. Nice, that that was a jump made, but unfortunately, the projectile was a little bit too close to, uh, to connect. Nice, another counter. Gonna put him into the corner, Dragoy keeping the pressure. The fast RC is gonna be blocked and good, jumps away. Nelkael reclaims the offense. He's got bars. It's time for the mix. Putting him into the corner. Gonna go for the super. And Oki behind that. Yeah, 
hard knock down. This is a very good spot for Nelka. Looking afford to slow things down again, but chooses not to. Chooses to go in once again. Look at this close up special. Oh, the burst! Very unlucky for Dragoy as Nelka has finished his offense, but two games back to back. And Nelka now sitting one game away from potentially tying the set. But every time that Nelka gets one game away, Dragoy makes it too, and this means that this is potentially a set point. It is actually a set point for Dragoy, but now Kel has to beat his inner demons and actually tie it up this time. Otherwise, it's curtains. Indeed, guys. Bets are open. Do you believe in the 6-6? Will we have a game number 13 in this absolute 6 set between the Italian Leo and the Spanish Kai? Nelkael versus Dragoy. Game number 12. Can Nelkael complete a full comeback. Go off on a woman. Believe in, in Nelkel. Uh, as he immediately <gasps> goes on to apply the pressure. Big DP with from Dragoy. This will be massive damage. The super will break the wall and put Dragoy in a very bad situation. Hard knockdown. And now the mix-up is from Nelkel. Nice block on the cross-up attempt. Maybe too, uh, too obvious and Dragoy saw it coming. And now it's time for Dragoy to apply some pressure at the corner. Nelkel with the job to get out Ooh. of the corner. Nice 2D into the RC. This could probably kill Dragoy off. Yes, it does, and one of the way from tying up the set. Nerkal has to still remain full force, full concentration. As a nice 2D counter hit will mean that Nerkal will keep on this head of steam into the throw at the corner. Oh. Now and again with the swift burst from Dragoy. All the pressure Nerkal is putting on him. It's working, but nice throw countering the, the dust. Oh, I'm surprised. I thought that would be safe. That's going to be in front as well. Another opening. Nerkal looking at Dragoy. Had to go for the reversal. It's not gonna happen. He's gonna be parried. Nel Kylo needs one more hit to go for game number 13. And he does. It is going to be 6-6. Six, six. Nel Kyle on his way to complete a full comeback. What a set it's been. Same set indeed. And Nel Kyle, we saw him last week. He could not make the comeback happen against Mystic Smash. But can he actually make it happen? Against Dragoy, a sick comeback from 6-3 uh, for, for Dragoy to 6-6. And Nelka has all the momentum in the world. It would definitely not be a surprise if he were to actually take it. Dragoy, on the other hand, has been playing out of his mind for most of the set. He cannot afford to have a dip in concentration, even for the slightest. Otherwise, Nelka will probably run away with it. But this is it. This is the final game in the set. We have gone the distance. Who will take it now, Kale against Dragoy, Italy against Spain, and Leo against Kyle? All right, bets are open. Who do you think will take that set so far? The money is on Nel Kyle's side, looking to keep his momentum up. And Dragoy is waiting in the corner. Nice burst from Dragoy, keeping him away. But what an air to air, Nel Kyle putting him into the corner. Solid damage there. He decides to keep, and that's gonna be the wall break. Nel Kyle with big boy damage into the Oki. For Nelkel, who now has uh, a lot of momentum going on, the positive bonus will be amazing for him as he will close the round with that 2 wage and this is now set point for Nelkel, who saw this coming, I definitely did not see the comeback happening for Nelkel as he starts off with a big project on nice defense, on the 2 wage, nice throw, putting Dragoy into the corner, now pressure is on the Spanish man, nice throw though from Dragoy, who puts Nelkel into the corner, nice burst from Nelkel getting out Ooh. of the corner, nice to decount it once again, so much mileage out of that move. Let's see now. Ooh, straight to the burst again. Dragoy is in trouble. There's gonna be an air to air. How much can he get with this? He does not have the super just yet, but that's gonna kill regardless. And Melkael will complete the full comeback from 6 3 to 7 6. The king takes it. Melkael.